Hey guys, my name is John with WCI, and today I'm going to show you all how to create some visuals within the Power BI. So we have our data loaded in. You can see that under the fields is our crime data. It's uh, going to show all the crimes in Philadelphia within a certain period of time. So I think the first thing that will look cool would be a map. So we have the longitude and latitude, which is all that we need to plot points. So we're going to click on the map visualization in the visualizations pane. And the little skeleton or ghost of visualizations can show up. Make that bigger. So we're going to drag the latitude and the latitude. Oops. And the longitude and the longitude. And then this will show all of our points right here, which is pretty cool. And then let's create a slicer. And you do that by clicking on the slicer visualization tool. Let's go ahead and put that over here. And maybe we're interested in checking out the crimes by district. So let's add in district into the field. And there's all these districts. And we can click on each individual district and see the different crimes in each district. Or maybe we're interested in slicing on the type of crime. So let's go ahead and create another slicer. And let's put in general text. There we go. And so let's check out where all the arson is committed. Oh, there's a lot of arson. Homicides. Cool. And then let's create a bar chart so that we can count the number of right. So let's do or the number of each type of crime in each district. So let's do text general for the axis and then text general for the value. And whenever we drag a character value or a string into a numerical field is going to do the count. So since we have homicide selected right here, this is just going to give us the count of homicides. It says there's 12. So if we unclick it, it's going to give us all of them. And let's sort this by count. smaller so we can see that theft is one of the largest along with vandalism narcotics and if we want to change this to a line graph we could just click right here and this will show us how many crimes are committed for each so let's look at uh, the date on this. So we can just change this to date, take that out. And now you have you can see the number of crimes committed per year. And those are some of the visualizations that you can do with Power BI. Thanks.